Good morning, hot dogs. Marching band and more after the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. There will be marching band and color guard practice for anyone interested Tuesday and Wednesday this week from 4 to 5. Anyone can join. Come to practice and join the show for the crown. AP tests start this week as we have AP U.S. government today. Make sure you know when it's your day to test and get a good night's sleep and nutritious breakfast. I wish everyone, including myself, the best of luck and go get a five. Now, let's send it to Esmeralda Cruz for a segment on the Raices Essay Contest. Hi, my name is Esmeralda Cruz, and as a part of the Raices Festival Committee, we would like to invite you to participate in this year's essay contest. The theme for the 2024 Raices Festival is Experiencing Latin America. And now I'd like to introduce you to our first place winner from the 2023 essay contest, Jose Alanis Mejia. Hi, I'm Jose, and this year you guys will have two options to choose to write to the essay. The first option is what contributions has Latin America made to the world? The second option is what is a part of the Latin American culture that a person needs to experience to have a better understanding of this part of the world? I would really take this opportunity because you can show people how proud you can be of your culture and show your writing skills to your teachers. The deadline to submit your essay is Wednesday, August 21st, before 5 p.m. on the email that appears on your screen. And thank you to the sponsorship from Lions Club. This year, our first place winner will receive $200, our second place will receive $100, and our third place will receive $50. Winner, winners will be recognized on stage during the Racist Festival, which will be taking place on Saturday, September 21st from 4 to 10.30 p.m. at Prairie Creek Park. Great segment, Esmeralda. We will air the Spanish version tomorrow, so be tuned in for that. Now, to everyone's favorite sports host of all time, Aiden Hudspeth. What's going on, dogs? Been a hot little minute since y'all have seen me on camera, but we're back with my signature sports reports. Over the weekend, the baseball team was jam-packed with action as they picked up the sweep over Peru and Western. The Hot Dogs defeated 13-2 host Peru, 6-3 in Game 1. Oscar Lopez earned the win with six strong innings, and Matthew Berry picked up the save with a perfect seventh inning. The team defeated number 7 ranked Western 13-4 in Game 2. Chino Valdez earned the win on the mound, and Lalo Castillo led the offense with four hits and five RBIs. Nice job, boys. Way to take care of business. We've got some action today from the boys and girls track teams taking a walk over the, across the practice field to host the Frankfurt Relays tonight. This will be taking place at 5.30. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Run them down. The girls tennis team will be having a home match tonight here at the Frankfurt Co courts against conference opponent Danville and that will be starting at 530 as well. And last but not least we've got the baseball team looking to keep things going smoothly as they will be here at home as well against the Raiders of Harrison. This will start at approximately 6 p.m. Wow the parking lot will be packed tonight. Make sure to pop out to all these different events to cheer on your fellow classmates. That'll wrap up my segment for today. Now I'll be sending it to Wayne Scott for this Monday weather report. Thank you, Aiden. Today it will be cloudy all day long with slight chance of showers about 50% up until 9 a.m., then dropping down to around 20% for the rest of the day. We will be having slight winds today ranging from around 6 to 9 miles per hour. The low for today will be 58 degrees as you felt it walking into school. Then, as you'll be leaving school this afternoon, it will reach the high of 73. That is all for me. Now I'll be sitting at Takai for lunch and birthdays. Basketball workouts start today in Case Arena as well as Wednesday from 5 to 7. On Wednesday before the, call, before the workout, there is a call-out meeting. Make sure you're there and to tell anyone you know or think is interested. For lunch in lines 1 and 2, it will be taco scoops and in lines 3 and 4, pasta. Special happy birthday goes out to Isidro Albino, Janet Calabero, Velasco, and Macy Duckworth. That's it for the announcements today, dogs. Have a great day, hot dogs.